It's a beautiful morning. Everybody is waking up. The birds are swimming in the pool. All moms and dads are going to work. The snake is walking in the zoo. He's looking at the elephant. And he's looking at the lion. And he's looking at the dinosaur. And now he's going home. The snake lives in a small house on top of a very high building. His rocket takes him to his house. The snake makes lunch, soup and some bread. Then he watches TV. He also likes to look at the view with his binoculars. The farmer is working very hard. Hey, what's that in the distance? Oh no, it's another attack from the gray. The gray swallows everything on its path. We have to save the city. The color wall needs to be switched on. It should protect the city from the attack. Oh no, the birds. I can still save them with my magic sword. Yes, they're free! The wall is not going to last long anymore. There's panic in the city. Oh no, the wall is down! The city is lost! And now it's only getting worse. The lion escaped from the zoo. No, the elephant escaped. No. The dinosaur escaped from the zoo. And it's also attacking the city. Rah! How are we going to survive this? Hey, the gray is also attacking the dinosaur. The dinosaur is so big, there are a lot of bricks in it. He can't move anymore. There are no more bricks to attack the city. The city is saved. Yay! Yay! Thomas, it's bedtime. Okay. Tomorrow I'm going to take the car and drive to the pool that's on top of the rainbow. And then I will take you and Daddy with the train in space to show you the